guys this video is going to be the update in this video i'm going to show you my unlocked matches on bumble i'm going to talk about <laughs> why i don't do a lot of online dating anymore and then i'll talk about how i choose the selection of women that i choose to date mm -hmm. as we look through some of the matches that's my homeboy texting me but uh yeah, let's go through this. I'm going to explain some things. And also, I'm going to update you on our first match, too. Because she stopped responding. And we're going to go over that a little bit, too. Why Why would a woman stop responding when you're messenger on a dating app? Or just in general, if you say you're texting her or whatever it could be. But first, let's look at the uh, reveal. This is Thursday. So we're going to be doing our boosting my profile today, later on. But right now, we're just going to look at these matches. Let's look at who liked me. All right, we already talked about said. I said this is a no for me. Now, keep in mind, I'm in the South. And this is the thing I do not like about the South. This makes some people mad. But in the South, women are overweight. <laughs> I'm not overweight. I have a fit body. I have abs. I'm not looking for any overweight women. So by that in itself... I, to be honest with you guys, I disqualify like 80% of women because if you're overweight, I, it's just never any chance for me, like you're like to be my girlfriend. Um, like, okay, so here we go. We're looking at the likes. I'm going to start with the, we're not going to look at the obvious pretty one. Cl Clarissa on the left looks pretty. We're going to skip over that. No, so I look at uh, this girl right here. Automatically, this is going to be a no just because of shape. Can't do it. All right. Let's look at the nearbys first because that's what matters. Nearbys. Um, I can see by her face here. That's too much for me. Yeah. Get it out the way. Um, this girl right here matches with me on every single dating app every single time. I never, I think I matched with her one time just to see what she was talking like. I think she speaks, she's like Jamaican or Caribbean or something. This girl right here, but never going to match with her. Has kids looking for a relationship. Yeah, I'm never going to match with this girl. But she matches with me on every single dating app. Yeah, she's Dominican or something. I can't remember what flag that is. But never going to match with her. She matches with me on every single dating app. Never going to match with her. Charmaine, this lady right here is going to be a no. I already told you guys why before we get into it. I figured that this person was going to be a match because they kept popping up on my everyone feed. Um, let's take a look. 41. Uh, let's see what she's got to say. She's in her season coming to her. So nothing's wrong with her bio. She's looking for a relationship. She has kids. She loves the gym, basketball, boxing concerts deep chats her face looks okay but this is makeup i don't count makeup as women looking pretty to be honest because i want to kind of know what the woman looks like without makeup and filters so that's kind of hard to judge off of this but it it looks cool with makeup uh body looks all right so that's not really overweight based on this it is i guess you would say we like to call women thick i guess but it's on the thicker side, but it doesn't look like out of control with her body shape. Um, yeah, it doesn't look too bad here. So I'm not that judgmental where like she gets some leeway because it's not like out of control body. She just has some, some meat on her bones. OK, so it's not bad. So she looks OK. So what I will do, I will I will let the light go through on this one. Even though she's got kids and wants a relationship, I will at least entertain a conversation with her and just see maybe we can hang out. I don't know how far anything will go. 
And you got to be the one to keep this in mind, guys. You're leading the interactions. You're the one that determines really what kind of goes on between you and her. She's not choosing you. I mean, she already chose me. So from here on, that's why you choose the women that already liked you. I'm kind of dictating whether I want to give her my time and schedule a date for her. Like she's the one getting the date. So I'm the one in charge. So we'll see. This girl right here uh, is automatic. No, based on this, there's no physical attraction here. Um, I do not like this lady's profile picture, but she actually is cute. See, look, yeah, when you look at that, that looks cute. The makeup doesn't look too heavy there. Um, but this photo I don't like as much. It's not a flattering hairstyle for her, in my opinion. But she's all right. She's all right. I'm not going to judge. She looks like a decent woman. Um, not a fan of red lipstick, but I'm not, I'm not really subtracting points. I'm just stating observations, but she st actually seems like she's like a cool looking girl. Now that picture looks a little bit more natural, but she might have a little bit of eyeshadow or something like that. Now I like that pic photo. This is really my best photo of her. Like my most, my most liked photo of her. This is a cute photo. So based on this, if she looks like this, in person that would be great so she also showed up on my um everyone feed so i figured that she was a match but i didn't care to do the trying to look at the pictures and name thing i showed you in the other video uh she likes breaking bad i like breaking bad she says she likes to cuddle that's cool um she seems cool she has one kid so that's not bad i i definitely don't mind one kid but when it starts getting more than one i uh, start thinking about it twice for sure and she says that she's looking for something casual she seems like a cool girl so i would actually like to just talk to her and meet her and see how things go she seems really cool nice chocolatey skin right there too i like that look and then i like the look in that last one so yeah we'll see what goes on with her all right um this girl right here automatic no for me all right, this girl right here, you can tell by her arms that she's not going to be my type physically. Um, she's looking for a relationship and wants kids someday. I look at that type of stuff because if I know that I'm not going to give them what they want, I don't like to even bother with them. I'm not too much of, I'm an animal, but I, I try to be respectful where I'm not going to waste both of our time too much, so... Those two things, I'm not going to give somebody kids or possibly a relationship straight up. The relationship is dependable. I'm not afraid to get in relationships. I will. I've actually dated women, got into relationships with women I met on dating apps. So I'm not afraid of that. Like I know some guys say, do not get in relationships with these women. Also, I'm not, I'm okay with getting in relationships because you can you really just get out of a relationship whenever you want, as long as you don't choose terrible. <laughs> But uh, no, I'm looking at this stuff like the body shape is not appealing to me. Her face isn't really appealing to me. She's very close to me. Honestly, she would be somebody I would friend zone and just want to meet and just see how her personality is. She seems like she could have a cool personality. I wouldn't want to lead her on, though, and think that I'm really looking for something. See, because she says after work, you can find me cooking dinner, relaxing. Yeah. I say I would like I would match with her just to see if she's like a cool person. Like she's like somebody I probably could learn new things from and experience. So I'm going to leave her there for right now. I'll decide what I'll do with her later. Then we've got her is going to be a skip. This person here, I felt like I've met her before. I felt like she matched with me before. And we've done a video chat. I think I feel like I've done a video chat with this girl before. How close is she to me? It says, um, so her body shape's a little bit much. And I know it's similar to the other girl that I did like, but I don't know here. I think the body is too much and I am not seeing a lot of things here that make me attracted to her visually. And that's what I'm afraid of. If I if I match with her, I may have to force myself to try to like her. And I don't want to do that. But I'm also, almost, I still try to keep an open mind. I could, 
I could just try to get to know her. So you got to keep the op option open. You can friend zone women too, and that's fine. There's plenty of women I've matched with, and I'll give them a chance. We'll talk and meet, and then I'll just decide, no, I don't really have a place for them in my life, like as friendship or anything else. So I, I won't do anything else with that. Interesting here. I'm going to like it just for conversation here and see. Um, although not a lot of things appealing about her photos to me, to be honest. But this is what the South has to offer, guys. Now, I will say I love traveling to other states and getting on the dating apps because then I can get to more attractive women. That's just the way it goes. If you're in a large city, you're going to have attractive women available to you. And I'm not in like a real, real big city here. Um, and I'm in the South and that's very unfortunate because women in the South are overweight and I don't want that. I'm not somebody that's overweight. I'm not looking for that. So that's going to be a no for her. Um, this girl here, she looks okay with her photos, has two kids looking for a gen gen genuine connection. And see, I'm not sure I'm going to be able to give her what she wants because she's got two kids. I'm just not interested in building a long-term relationship with a woman that has two or more kids so I don't want to waste her time and plus I don't see enough here that makes me want to get to know her so I'm going to go not for me all right so that was all the oh this girl skip that I don't know who that is calling me all right this girl here Clarissa I like this photo a little blurry kind of filtery so let's keep looking she's a mom Man, I got to expect this a lot of girls going to have kids. She's looking for someone who's honest, consistent, communicates, and God-fearing. I always wonder what they mean by God-fearing because I don't know many women of our generation that actually are really religious. So I think they put that there as a filter for guys, obviously. Uh, says she's not looking for just a good time or friends with benefits. She wants a real long-lasting relationship. So she sounds... As if she's a good girl. She likes anime. Road trips. Festivals. So she's looking for a relationship. And she doesn't say how many. Kids she has. Photos don't. That photo does not look that good for her. This one's okay. Not a fan of red lipstick. This one's better right here. And that was a good, so she's got a good body type. I will say that a woman in the South, that's not overweight. That's she gets points for that. And that's decent right there, I guess. So once again, not a lot here that would visually attract me to her. I mean, you're not always going for visually attractive, but you want to have something there. Um, see, this one looks like she can put herself together nicely. Um, she says, looking for something real that will lead to a long-lasting relationship. See, I don't know if I can give that to her. But I will, at least for conversation purposes, I will like her and just speak with her. And then we'll see. See if she just wants to hang out. She says she's not looking for just a good time, though. So I'll just talk to her and see. I don't like this photo, though. I think she should, should find a better photo for that one. And I know my photos are going to be judged, too, which is why... You know, keep that in mind, guys. My matches aren't as great because my pictures aren't as great. So your quality of your pictures are going to improve the quality of the women that, that match with you. So those are all the nearbys. Uh, leave Amanda there for now. Um, so let's keep going through the rest. Um, this is going to be a no. And these women are farther away, so they have to look better or provide something else to me. Um, these are no's. This is a no. Yeah, look, I mean, just look at her in these all face photos. Yeah, that's a lot. I can't do that. This woman, uh, that, um, she does look a little bit rough here for 37. Okay, all the tattoos and stuff is interesting. Okay. Interesting. Adwa. So is she an African or something like that? Probably. We're just going to go no. No, thank you. 
See guys, so I know this you're looking oh no. That's a TS. Oh no. What the heck? Now that's in Charlotte. Now if I did I need to do another experiment, make another account and do Charlotte. If I do Charlotte, I'm gonna find more attractive women for sure. Is actually where I get a lot of the best matches. Uh, of course, you might see more stuff like this, but what the heck? This is very common to be, believe it or not that they will match with you. Uh, interesting, interesting guys. Uh, this is another one. Oh no, that's a that's a girl. Sorry. Um, uh, nope. Uh, no, thanks. Uh, photos are too close to your face. She doesn't. Oh, she looks so like cute and innocent. Let me see something. She's 35. Quirky, semi goofy, floating to the end of curiosity. She doesn't know what she's looking for yet. Doesn't know she wants kids. So she looks like a quiet, uh, nerdy girl here. This is interesting. She's far though, so I'm definitely no. Oh, okay. Well, she responded quick. Okay. Um, sorry. Let's finish this. Um, <sighs> I'm not gonna say nothing. I'm not gonna say nothing. Okay. She looks straight. The smile is kind of a little wicked or something. I don't know what's up with that, but okay. She's smiling, but okay, yeah, she's got a little bit of weight on her. See, and I try to think, how hard is it to pick her up? That's going to be hard. She looks, so she's smiling. She looks like she'd be cool to hang around. But yeah, that'll be about it. And she's looking for marriage. Honestly, uh, I would conversate with, I would converse with her just to see, like, hey, talk to her. But I wouldn't try to do nothing scandalous, like try to just smash her or nothing like that, because I wouldn't want to lead her on. Uh, and this is too much for me. But some people I do that. It's just, hey, let's just have a conversation. And so you guys got to have not have thirst in your body. I get you want to get with a woman. Um, but you got to not have thirst in your body. And that is it, unfortunately. So we're going to come back later. I'm going to be doing some, I'm going to do a boost on my profile. I'm going to look and see if I can find some better pictures before I boost. Um, I'll respond to this girl as well. I'm going to make all this another video because I know I promised I was going to put a lot in this, but it's getting quite long. So I'm just going to just going to retitle the video to talk about my matches. But this is not bad. Let me see. If she has a kid looking for a relationship. She doesn't say how many kids. OK. Very interesting here. She might be good, though. It might be good to go on a date. Anyway, thanks for watching, guys. Uh, make sure you stay tuned for the next one. Gonna see if some of these women respond, see how the conversations go. And then also we're going to do some super swipes. We're going to swipe on some women later, stuff like this. I swipe on her uh, just, okay, that is rough looking right there. Yeah, we're going to talk more about how to swipe through women as well later, all right?